self tan last night, if you can't tell. <laughs> so I'm gonna hop in the shower and wash it off and then I'm gonna go get the kids up. <laughs> What are you no. doing? No. Have you no. Trying to find a shirt that my belly doesn't hang out of and it is impossible. Matt's watching me sit in the driveway from the house. Uh, I'm running to get a haircut. I did not want to put on makeup today, but all I could think about was me just like sitting there staring at myself in the mirror while I was getting a haircut and I was like, better put a little bit of makeup on. So I'm gonna go and get a coffee and something small for breakfast. We're gonna go get our hair cut and then we're gonna come back, get the fam and see what's going on today. There's actually no line at Starbucks today. I'm the second person, which is really surprising. I thought it would be a long line on a Saturday morning. A salted caramel cold brew and a banana loaf. Y'all have to tell me if you do this too, but I will not make a scary left turn. Like I will turn right any day and loop around even if it adds like 10 minutes to my trip because I'm not making a scary left turn. So I need to go left, but we're going right. <laughs> I feel so bad when I get Starbucks because Seven Brew is right across the street and I am like so loyal to Seven Brew, but I love their energies and I just don't think you're supposed to have that during pregnancy. So I've been going to Starbucks for cold brew but I'll be back for you, Seven Brew. But the Seven Brew energy, I get the strawberry kiwi. Oh my goodness. Like getting that on the way to the beach or like on the way to go do something outdoors during the summer is such a staple. It's my favorite. Anyway, this isn't sponsored by Seven Brew or anything. <laughs> the reason I'm getting my hair cut and not colored is because I cannot decide what I want to do to like the color of my hair. I do miss like the warm brunette look, but I also don't know if that's because it's still cold outside. So I'm trying to just hold off until summer and see like if I feel like I wanna go more blonde or if I still like the brunette during summer because I, like I said, I just feel like it's like all the cozy vibes right now. And that might be why I'm missing the darker hair. I'm gonna go ahead and go in and I'll see y'all in a bit. I told her to start easy with the layers because I didn't want to get a bunch of layers and then have like a shock and regret it. So of course I'll go home and play with it some. I'm gonna head home and see what the family's doing. Hey. Hey. There's a camera that I've really been wanting but it's out of stock and back ordered everywhere. 
And the BX, which is like the military base store, says that they have six in stock. I'm not sure if I believe it because it's literally back ordered even on the Canon website. Um, but we drove over to base to see if we can find it. So fingers crossed. Do you think they're gonna have it, babe? No. Or do you think their website's wrong? They're wrong. They seriously have tons of them. Daddy, I like you. Shocked that they had this, and they had like six of them. But I was up so late last night, like looking at forums, and everywhere this camera is sold out. Matt's actually the one that told me to look at the VX, so he does get credit. So we got to get the cheap gas while we're on base. Get that, Sissy brought you a lollipop? Yeah. I only told him like 17 times the camera that I wanted, but somehow he was very surprised by the price. Just yes. so go ahead. Yes. <laughs> How are your food? Quesadillas. Quesadillas. <laughs> Most are good. I just jumped back in the shower and washed my hair. So you can see like the layers that she put in and a little bit of face framing, but I love it. I'll see if I can get a shot of the back. Mm. In bed with my pregnancy pillow and my water. And I'm gonna take a little nap. Honestly, ridiculous how many times I've changed today, but I get really bad sensory overload. And the sweater and my hair being parted down the middle and <laughs> just the tiniest little things can send me like just into major discomfort. So I'm in a big t-shirt and I feel better now. It's way later. I think it's like 5.30. Do you know what time it is? 5.30. We're watching a movie. Baby Boss. We're watching Baby Boss and I think it's called Boss Baby. Oh yeah. Boss Baby. Uh, hello, Baby Boss. Yes. Okay. Yes. Matt's downstairs okay, making the kids something to eat and then we're gonna go over to our friends. Coming at you from the new vlogging camera. You think we're gonna make awesome videos with us? Yes. Yeah, Especially we do. on the beach. Wait. I know when we get to take the boat out, but we won't get it in the water. Ah, the quality's so good. What are you doing back there? Hush. Do you have a mouth full of water? Wow. Thank you. Okay, we're about to go to our friends and I need a jacket because it's like 20 degrees out. This jacket is huge. That's so nice of you. Huh? That's so nice of you. Baby, come, give me something. Come I got on. it. <laughs> you need your phone? Yeah, can you get my phone? Yeah. I got the essentials, a water, a lemonade, and some spicy Doritos. <laughs> Look, I got a new vlogging camera! Y'all are both dancing. That's a good music. Barbara wants to watch, right? Holy moly, who made this big mess? Mm. I wanted to see how this worked in the low light. Look how bright it still is. It is bright. It's nice, right? Cozy. Put the blanket because it's freezing. Hey guys, it's way later and the kids just got into bed. I'm taking off my makeup and gonna get into bed myself. Matt, I think, is downstairs finishing some football game. We ended up door dashing Chick fil A and kind of having like a little second dinner. And I think after we ate, we just got so tired. <laughs> Did you see how fast Grayson's hair is growing? Mm -hmm. Like, I feel like, how long has it been since he got that haircut? Two weeks. Will you leave that out?
Me and my friend are running to Target because Matt's off work today. So he's gonna hang out with the kids this morning and go, I think get some stuff for dinner. You're going to get steaks? Steaks. I'm gonna go to- Beans, tomatoes, potatoes. Really? I'm gonna go to Target and do some girl things. I'll look and see what spring clothes that they have out. Keep going back and forth on whether or not I wanna wear this hat. Hat, no hat. Hat, no hat. Can I see? No, actually, um, no hat. What do you think? Yeah. Hat. Looks more like winter. Matt says hat. This is my outfit. It's just Amazon leggings, Vans, DSG, DSG sweatshirt. Nike hat. I have this little Kalia by Carrie, Carrie Underwood's brand, um, that I'm just gonna throw my money and my phone in. Water, ice water. I need some more. Okay. Also, I feel like my face is so dry, so. I'm about to go put some more moisturizer on. In my little bag, I'm putting, yes. Money and ID, Aquaphor chapstick, cutie hand sanitizer, and my phone. Brantley's already eyeballing my little purse. She like has a thing for little purses. I don't use this every day, but when my skin's really dry, I love the Drunk Elephant peptide cream. friend's about to be here so let's go you know what she texted me and she was like let me know when you're here and I totally forgot I'm driving I was sitting there waiting for her but she normally drives but funny story last time we drove to go shopping together okay so we're both pregnant she's 20 she's 28 weeks and I'm 26 weeks we're like exactly two weeks apart or maybe like two weeks and a couple days apart. But anyway, last time we went shopping together, we drove down to Hobby Lobby. I think I like had an espresso that morning, but I didn't eat, I don't know. But I had like a major pregnancy moment and got super car sick and threw up in the Hobby Lobby parking lot. It was like the most embarrassing moment of my life, but it was so funny because I'm literally in the passenger seat. We just parked and I was like, no, I know I'm gonna throw up but I'm gonna go inside Hobby Lobby. Like, I'm making it inside Hobby Lobby. And she was like, no, just throw up in the parking lot. And I was like, I don't wanna throw up in the parking lot. I don't want anybody to see me. And like, as I'm saying that, I'm like, let me just take a quick drink of water. I forgot my water, I have to go get that. But anyway, I was like, let me just take a quick drink of water, take a drink of water, and no, that was it. I was done, totally threw up in the Hobby Lobby parking lot. So this morning I'm like, do you want to drive like you normally like to drive? And she was like, mm, no, <laughs> like, you better drive. We don't need you getting sick again. And I'm like, fair, fair. So I'm going to go get her and I need to run back in and get my water. But also look at this amazing tripod that I got yesterday. It's really, really, really lightweight. I got it at the BX where we got my camera but I'll try to find it on Amazon and link it. Got the water. And some sunglasses. We're supposed to leave at like seven o'clock this morning. <laughs> Last night we had such high hopes at the end of the night that we were gonna go to Target at 7 a.m. and like be done by nine. Have all this construction going on by our house and they didn't start until eight. So we slept in until eight. I feel like the construction is like our alarm clock every morning. Um, so yeah, we're getting a little bit of a late start, but we're definitely gonna get some food because nobody needs to be throwing up in parking lots today. It's a breath of fresh air that Matt's off work all weekend just because, I don't know, he's so dedicated and he works so hard, but like sometimes you just need a few days of no work and just to be able to do the little things. Don't you appreciate the relationships like where your kids are friends, your husbands are friends, and your friends, like that is like the pinnacle of friendships right there. Because when we wanna do something like this, like the guys are so for it because already they're thinking about like, oh, we wanna do this football game or we wanna do 
whatever whiskey tasting like y'all go go you deserve it do your thing but really they're like planning something on the back end which is totally fine you guys notice that i just drove to her house like while on camera they literally live in our neighborhood and it's just i don't know it's amazing there she goes with her hot pink cup and hot pink hat just like me we're meant to be hey mama Hola. I, a hat too. I know I was debating the hat and Matt said it fit my uh, aesthetic, aesthetic. <laughs> you'll have to watch my YouTube and <laughs> hear my story about when I threw up in the Hobby Lobby parking lot <laughs> look at Katie's little teeny tiny espresso yeti it's so cute it's a perfect size it, it, I got oh, <laughs> Where'd Grayson go? It's quite a bit later in the afternoon, about 3.15, but while me and Katie were at Target, Matt and Katie's husband took all the kids and they went to brunch and they went to Walmart and picked up steaks for tonight. Did our shopping, we got Starbucks and we ended up getting Chipotle for takeout and brought that here because we don't have a Chipotle. They're building one and I'm so excited, but for right now we don't have a Chipotle and we got back and all the kids were playing. Um, they played for a little bit longer and then Katie and Derek took their kids home. Grayson's taking a nap right now. I am about to start editing. I think that's it. Around this time every day, I feel like I want to take a nap, but it's like, I just feel like it's so late in the day. Like if I actually do fall asleep, like it kind of makes my afternoon super groggy. I'm going to try to stay up and just get some work done rather than take a nap, even though I want to so bad. We got a bunch of really good goodies at Target. They didn't have kids spring clothes out. It was still like wintry, warmer weather clothes. So I'll have to go back and get a bunch of kids spring clothes because I was hoping to find that. And tonight, like almost every Sunday night, we have a ton of laundry to fold. We have kind of a big mess just from the kids like playing and having friends over and doing all that here. Um, so we're gonna clean up the upstairs a little bit. We'll do steaks, bath, bedtime, prep for the week. Probably gonna pack lunches tonight just because it always makes the mornings better. Um, but yeah, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay, so it's actually the next day. It's almost lunchtime on Monday. Well, I realized that we didn't even end up filming the rest of last night, but I just wanted to give you guys a little recap of our night. Matt cooked a really, really yummy steak for dinner. Even Archie got some. He was so excited. And we had the kids clean upstairs because after having friends over, it's like a disaster no matter what. We always save all of our laundry for Sunday. Um, so we did that. I packed lunches for today just to kind of save myself the hassle this morning. We did bath time and got everybody ready for today. We try to like do all the things on Sunday night just so that we can kind of set ourselves up for a good week starting Monday. I will say that I did edit the majority of this video last night and so sad I completely destroyed my MacBook Pro. I'm new. Like that's all I can say. I'm new here. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm like getting all this new equipment and it just could not handle like editing this at all. So that's really sad because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to drop a big chunk of money this week at getting a new computer, but it is needed. And I think with that being said, we just wanna say like how thankful we are that you watched our video. We're thankful you're here. I don't know how you found us, like if you wanna leave in the comments, like if you found us on YouTube or if you're coming to us from like TikTok or Instagram, I would love to hear. Um, we are so new to this space and we are all so excited to be on YouTube and like we just have so many things to share with you guys and this is just the beginning. Some things coming up this week, I'm gonna be sharing some work from home content, just like how I stay productive, how our week flows. I am also a full-time student, so just kind of how I manage everything within the week and like try to be as present as possible. I work a full-time corporate job from home. Of course, we have the kiddos. Almost seven months pregnant with our fourth. And then of course I do content creation full-time. So I have a Tampa trip planned this weekend. So we do plan to vlog that. So see some Tampa content coming through. And again, I just wanna say how thankful we are for you guys. And we're so aware that it is such an intentional act to like sit down and watch like a 15 to 20 minute YouTube video. And we're so thankful that you're watching ours. So stick around. If you're new here, stay tuned. And yeah, we love you guys. Bye.